house again today. What a blessing it is to see each and every one that uh, is here with us. Amen. You pray today that God will have His way in everything that is said and done today that we can go out of here saying that being good. Amen. To be in the house of the Lord. And, uh, just pray today for the message. Amen. We uh, studied, studied, studied on this. Amen. We hope and pray that uh, Hope and pray that we can lead out of here uh, a little bit closer to God. Amen. Amen. Than we was when we come in. Amen. Amen. But if you have your Bibles and you want to read uh, with us this morning, we're going to be on the book of Leviticus. Amen. Chapter number 13. Amen. I want you to listen to the reading of God's Word and then we want to go from there. Amen. And come over into the book of uh, book of Mark. Amen. And uh, uh, chapter number one, amen, down at the verse number 40, amen. And I want you to listen real close to the reading of God's Word, amen. In uh, Leviticus chapter number 13, verse number one, And the Lord spoke, uh, spake unto Moses and Aaron, saying, When a man shall have uh, in the skin of his flesh a rising, a scab or bright spot, and it to be in the skin of the flesh like the plague of leprosy. Then he shall be brought unto Aaron the priest or unto one of his sons of the priest. And the priest shall look upon the plague in the skin of the flesh. And when the hair in the plague is turned white and the plague in sight be deeper than the skin of his flesh, it is a plague of leprosy. And the priest shall look upon look on him and pronounce him unclean. Amen. Now let's go over into uh, uh, the book of Mark. Amen. In chapter number 1. Amen. Down in verse number uh, 40. Amen. Then we'll go to the Lord in prayer. And it said, And there came a leper to him, beseeching him, kneeling down to him, and saying unto him, If thou wilt, Thou canst make me clean. Amen. Let us pray. Father, dear Lord, it's again, God, that we come to you with humble hearts today. Thanking you, Lord, for this day. Thanking you, Father, for another opportunity, Lord, to be in your house. And God, to be behind the sacred nest today. And Lord, we pray today, God, that you would have your way, Lord, in everything, God, that is said and done. And Father, we thank you today, Lord, for the opportunity, God, of being here, Lord. And Father, we pray that, God, if we've done or said anything throughout this week, Lord, that would hinder this in any way, God, we pray tonight, Lord, that you'd forgive us of it, pull us up close to the cross, and God, to make preaching and teaching easy. And Lord, how we love you today. And Father, we pray today, God, to have your way, Lord, in everything, God, that is said and done. And Father, whatever's accomplished, Lord, we'll not fail, God, to bow our head and, Lord, to give you the praise and the honor and the glory. For, Lord, we ask it all in Jesus' holy and precious name we do pray. And amen. amen. And amen. You know, as we uh, uh, read over in the book of uh, uh, Leviticus, amen, about... Uh, the plague of the leprosy. Amen. They say that that is one of the awfulest diseases, amen, that you can have. Amen. That it'll, it'll, it'll start out in a, in a little spot and pretty soon it'll go out all over your body. Amen. And, uh, back in the scripture, back in the Olden Testament, amen, whenever, uh, a person had leprosy, amen, they was isolated, amen. They wasn't allowed to be in the temple, they wasn't allowed to come and worship, amen. They was put off in a place by themselves, amen. And if anybody would get close to them, amen, their, their instructions was that they was a, a, a holler out, amen, that they was unclean, amen. And they had leprosy, amen, for people to stay away from them. Well, as we get into that and we begin to study the Scripture, we find out what God is appointed to and what the Lord is appointing, amen, is a picture of sin, amen. And more 
boy, I'm telling you how how sneaky sin is. Amen. Amen. And boy, I'm telling you what, uh, uh, sin is something that you got before you even know you got it. Amen. 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 And boy, I'm telling you what, it's a trouble with a lot of people today. Now we find, amen, that uh, the leprosy, amen, it would start out with a little scab, amen, and then they would have to go into the priest, amen. Then if the priest would look upon that leprosy, and, amen, that leprosy would go deeper than what the skin was, amen. In other words, it would go down in the skin, amen, and begin to work. And you know, that's just like sin this morning, amen. A sin might start out on the top, amen, but pretty soon it uh, moves to the inner depths of our soul, amen. And boy, I tell you, sin uh, uh, will, uh, will to cause people uh, uh, to destroy their self, amen. We find, uh, amen, that the leprosy, uh, uh, boy, once it went deeper than the skin, uh, and they was pronounced as having a uh, leprosy, amen. And they was unclean. Don't you know, amen, that according to the word of God, amen, that Romans 3 and 23 uh, said that we've all sinned and come short of the glory of God. Amen. Romans chapter number 5 said, uh, uh, boy, that he died for us uh, even when we was ungodly. Uh, he shed his blood for us. Amen. Uh, and you know what we had a case of? Uh, we had a case of sin. Uh, Amen. And boy, I tell you how uh, that the sin will go down uh, underneath the skin. Amen. Boy, anything uh, that is underneath the skin, uh, one of these days will appear uh, to the surface. Amen. Uh, brother, I'm telling you today, uh, the Bible said that they uh, will pronounce them unclean. Uh, boy, don't you know uh, whenever we got sin in our life uh, and sin Sin is the controlling a uh, uh, substance in our life. Uh, you know what God does? Uh, he pronounces us unclean uh, and unfit uh, uh, to be one of His children. Uh, uh, but I'm glad this morning, uh, Amen, that God uh, has the ability uh, uh, to save uh, and to cleanse up uh, and to put us back uh, on track Amen. this morning. Amen. Amen. We find out that. Not only whenever sin gets involved in our life, amen, this thing and how that a sin, amen, it'll spread over the body and it'll go deeper, amen. Uh, boy, that old uh, leprosy, amen, it would go deep and then it would begin to spread, amen. Uh, boy, you know sin spreads this morning, amen. Boy, I know the people that had a little old sin, amen. And boy, they said, well, it's not really all that bad. And then the first thing you know, that little old sin lead to something else, amen. Then that lead to something else, and then that lead to something else, amen. Sin is an awful disease. Amen. It's killed many of American people. It's caused many people in this life to die and go to hell. Amen. Because they was unclean and unfit for heaven. Amen. Listen today. The only reason that I'm going to be able to enter in one of these days is because of what Jesus has done. Amen. A more sin will spread in not only a spread by the you, but it spread off of you uh, and of somebody else. Amen. That's the reason they put the leopards. Uh, amen. They told them, said, you got to be isolated. Uh, you got to be by yourself. Amen. Uh, and the only other people uh, uh, that could be around you was that uh, uh, that had leprosy. Amen. Uh, and boy, ain't sin about like that. Uh, amen. Whenever sin gets into our life uh, and it begins to take over uh, and it begins to rule our heart. Amen. The only people that we want to be with is other people that are sinners too. Because we got something in common. Amen. Listen today. The boy with the great healer comes by, you know, the swan. The leopard said, the leopard said, I know you can cleanse me. Amen. Boy, ain't you glad today? There's one in the midst. Amen. That is great. Greater uh, than anybody uh, we've ever come in contact with, uh, and He is able uh, to cleanse us uh, uh, from our sin uh, and all of our ungodliness uh, and put us on the road uh, uh, that leads to heaven. Uh, he's the only one uh, that can take a sinner uh, and make a righteous man uh, or a righteous woman. 
God. Amen. 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 But you Amen. know what sin does? Sin isolates you. Amen. 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 Sin will isolate you. Amen. That's the reason why the church, amen, is over half empty this morning. Amen. Because sin isolates people. Amen. When they get out and they get sin in their life, amen, and sin begins to take over and it begins to spread. Amen. They don't want around any preaching. Amen. They don't want around anybody. Amen. That, amen. It believes in God. Amen. Amen. They'd rather hang with the with the party that they're comfortable with. Amen. Listen to they boys what preacher. sin will do to you. Amen. A sin will draw you away from the presence of God. Amen. When Adam and Eve sinned in the garden, first thing they wanted to do amen. is to go and hide. Amen. They said, Boy, we know that he comes through in the cool of the day. Amen. Yeah. And boy, the cool of the day, they was down in the bushes. Amen. Yeah. In behind the trees. Yeah. Listen. Amen. This church has been here for several years. Amen. I've been here going on seven. Amen. This Sunday, Sunday school's always been at 10. Preaching's always been at 11. Amen. Sunday night's always been at 5. Amen. Wednesday night's always been at 7. Amen. Yeah. This evening, it ain't lie. We quit we switch the time up uh, where you don't know what time to be here. Amen. It's been the same time uh, for over seven years and longer than that. Uh, amen. It ain't that people don't know uh, what time the service is. Uh, amen. They got a little bit of guilt going on. Amen. Uh, amen. They seem to be whether uh, uh, stay out of the presence of God uh, rather than to be in uh, uh, the presence of God. Uh, amen. Boy, I tell you, there was times uh, when these old people uh, that had this leprosy uh, and again anything in the world uh, to be able to go in uh, and to worship God. Amen. Uh, brother, when there's sin in our life, uh, we can come in, uh, but we can't worship. Uh, amen. You can't amen. worship uh, until you get the sin uh, and go out of your life. Uh, uh, brother, they ain't no need uh, uh, trying to strive of the fear. If you won't straddle of the fear long enough, you're going to get hurt. Amen. Amen. Preach on. You're going to get hurt. Come Preach on. on. I tried that one time. Yeah, I've been there. Amen. Walking straddle of the fence. Mm -hmm. Amen. Something happened. My feet slid out from in under me. Well, Amen. Well. I sang high tenor for about two weeks. <laughs> Amen. Walking straddle of the fence. Amen. It ain't no fun. Come on. Amen. Boy, I'm telling you, sin will cause you. Amen. It'll, it'll cause you to want to stay away. Yeah. Amen. From what is right. Amen. 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 People put everything in the world yeah. ahead of them and God. Amen. Amen. Listen, this morning, there's coming a payday. Amen. Boy, we find out. Amen. That leprosy and not only defiles, but it isolates, but it spreads to others. Amen. Amen. This morning, boy, I tell you what, you might say, preacher, I ain't doing anything but hurting myself. It's a lie, you know. Amen. 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 When you hurt yourself, That's amen, right. by having sin in your life, it affects everybody That's around right. you. Right. Amen. It affects them that loves you. It affects them that is wanting to help you. Amen. I can always tell uh, when somebody's out of the will of God. Amen. Brother, I tell you, miss for a few Sundays, you call them and tell you about run the battery in your telephone, Dad. Amen. And the only thing you get is a a stupid answering machine. Amen. 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 He'll say at the sound of the beep, leave me a message and I'll call you back. Amen. Boy, I tell you, I've left enough messages on people's telephone. They probably had to go out and get them a new messenger machine. Amen. Amen. Listen this morning. They don't want to talk to me. They don't want anybody. Right. Amen. They're just going to tell them about the goodness of God. Amen. Why? They say, because the sin in their life has spread. Amen. And boy, I tell you, when it spreads, it'll draw you further and further and further away from God. That's Amen. right, preacher. Preach Come on. on. This book Preach on. will keep you from sin. Amen. Or sin will keep you out of this book. That's a fact. Amen. Amen. If you want to be a child of God, amen, boy, I'm telling you what, 
Now, when they had this leprosy, amen, and boy, they colonies would grow. And people that had this leprosy, when they took their clothes off, amen, you know what they had to do? <laughs> they had to burn their clothes. Sure amen, this season we find out that leprosy in the Bible, the only thing that it presented, amen, was something that was ready to be burned. Amen. amen, something that was ready for the fire. Amen, amen. might I tell amen, you tonight, preacher. amen, when sin uh, presents you to God, amen, this season, you know what sin is presenting yes, to God? Sir. It's amen. presenting something that is no fit I for try. anything but to be burned up. Amen, amen. this morning, see, sin, it'll cause you a lot of grief on this side. Amen. amen. It'll cause you a lot of trouble in this life. Amen. amen. But boy, you ain't seen nothing yet. Amen. amen. Whenever sin gets done, amen, and we stand before a God, amen, that is holy and righteous, and He looks down upon our life, and our life is filled out with sin, we're in worse shape than what that old leopard was. Amen. amen. And the leopard man come to God. Amen. And He know that He was supposed to be be isolated. He know that ever whenever he entered somebody, I come close to somebody that he had to tell them who that he was. Amen. But he know Jesus had the answer. Amen. 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 He know that Christ Woo. had what he needed. Amen. Yeah. When we realize that we were an all sinner. Amen. When we realize that Jesus has what we need. Amen. amen. And what we need is a good old soul cleansing. Amen. 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 What we need, thank God, is to be purified again in the sight of God. And boy, that old leopard said, man, he said, I've heard about this one, and I know that he's able. Amen. He didn't come to the Lord and say, God, I think you can. He come to God saying, I know. Amen. 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 Brother, I tell you, ain't it's you glad? And today, thank God, I know a man that can. Amen. Amen. Is Jesus Christ? this morning, what an awful thing it is to die with this disease. Amen. Preach on what they call the silent killer. Preach on. Amen. That's your heart. Yep. Yeah. Amen. Something about your heart that is a silent killer. You have that major heart attack without even knowing you're having a heart attack. Yeah. And just all at once, you're dead. Yeah. Amen. It's happened to the young. It's happened to the old. That's right. It's happened to the middle age. Amen. It's happening all over our world. Amen. You take sin. <laughs> sin sort of like a cancer. Yeah. Amen. Cancer gets into your organs. Amen. If you don't treat it, amen, if you don't try to take steps, <laughs> <laughs> to get rid of that cancer. You know what that cancer will do? It'll spread yeah. from the lungs, amen, over into the liver. Amen. It'll spread from the liver over into the bones. Amen. This evening I got an uncle right now. Amen. That is about 80 years old. That is plumb, totally ate up with cancer. Amen. He got cancer everywhere. Amen. It's all in his bone. He can't hardly walk. Biggest thing that he does anymore. Amen. He's just sat in a chair and cry. He's so weak he can't get up. Amen. This scene, now listen, boy, I'm telling you, that cancer is an awful thing. And this leprosy, amen, was a whole lot like the cancer was. I was reading a little bit on it, boy, and they said that it would eat. Uh, uh, spread into your fingertips, amen, and into the tips of your toes, and uh, amen, boy, how that it, it would get them to where they would literally just fall off, amen, this, and you couldn't function as a human being. Ain't that what sin does to us, amen? amen. A sin gets us to where we can't function, amen. A sin gets you to a spot, amen, to where you ain't got anything left to live for, amen. I believe and there's some of these boys that have leprosy in the Bible, I believe that if you could go back and talk to them, you know what they tell you? They'd say, I just as soon be dead. Amen. It's to live like this. Amen. They was isolated from their family. Amen. They was isolated from the temple. They was isolated from anything. Amen. They lived right in their own colony. Boy, don't sin. Have their own colonies. Amen. They got the nightclubs. Amen. They got the drinking clubs. They got the 
restraint joints. Amen. They got every ungodly thing in the world. They don't offer people. But it don't let you know what's going on on the other side of the homes that is being broken up. Amen. The kids that go to bed hungry. Amen. This scene in the marriages that goes down the toilet. Amen. Boy, I tell you what. How that it is wrecked. Life after life after life. Amen. 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 Preach on. Come on, preacher. We have a shooting. We'll show you something. We have a shooting. Amen. The first thing you do is they don't talk very much about the shooter. It's all about the gun. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Come on, Amen. preacher. How they, That's they right. Wanna, how they want to block people. Yeah. They Come on. Having guns. Yeah. yeah. Amen. How they want to make it illegal yeah. for having firearms. Uh -huh. Amen. You get an alcoholic out on the road. There you go. Amen. So drunk that he can't stand up. Mm -hmm. Amen. Hits a vehicle, kills about three kids. Amen. And their parents. You don't ever hear anything about it. Amen. That's right. Well, he was driving underneath the influence. Amen. Yeah. You never hear anything about wanting to ban alcohol. Amen. Yeah. Wanting to take alcohol off of the shelf. You want to know why tonight? Amen. That's where the money's at. Amen. Right. That's where the money keeps flowing in. Amen. Right. And they don't want That's to right, cut off that Come on, preacher. Amen. There are thousands and thousands of dollars a year. Amen. Yeah. That the liquor stores and the alcohol beverages that's they right. see to open up houses they man to rehab people and to try to get them off of the junk and when they get on it hey man boy I tell you what the only one that is able to break the house is Jesus is Amen Come on that's a fact So right. after these people die the only thing that you can do with everything they own, you had to burn it. Burn it. Everything. You had to burn it. Yes, Lord. Listen this morning. If we live in sin and we die in sin, mm -hmm. the only thing that our life <coughs> is fit for Amen. is to be burned. Yep. Okay. That's it. True. Bless them, Lord. Who put us in that predicament? That's so, all. We did. Yeah. Amen. We did. Yeah. Amen. Who helps us? Who makes us walk astray? Mm. Jesus. Amen. Well, my Bible tells me. He said, Greater is he that lives in you Amen. than he that lives Bless in you. Bless the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. 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 This morning, brother, I'm telling you, when we get off track, yeah. We put ourselves off track. Amen. Amen. It ain't anybody else's fault. Amen. Amen. This morning, I, I guarantee you, and I'll go so far as to say this, if anybody that is not here this morning would say, I'm not in church on account of that preacher, they're lying. Amen. Amen. Because the only thing I've done for the past seven years tell you the truth. Amen. 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 And the Amen. truth sometimes well, gets Lord. right down Amen. to where it hurts. Amen. The truth gets right down to where, yeah, where the rubber meets the road yeah, sometimes. Truth Listen, hurts, boy, boy I'm telling you what, it's old leopard, man. A leopard, see, in the Old Testament, they couldn't quit being leopards wow. because that's, they wanted That's right. Because they had that disease. Exactly. This boy in the picture in Mark he was declared to be a leopard yep. he couldn't quit being a leopard uh -uh. just because he wanted to be amen he needed some help amen, amen. so you can't quit being a sinner just because you want to quit being amen. a sinner you need some help amen to quit being a sinner Sure I know. You say, preacher, how you know? Done been down that road. Yeah, Amen. Right. Amen. 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 Every ungodly Amen. need that there was to do. Amen. Amen. And I tried over a thousand and a million times to quit, and I couldn't. Amen. Amen. I was like the old leopard. I needed some help. Amen. And then Amen. one night, somebody preached to me about Jesus. Amen. Amen. And I met the man that can. Amen. Cleanse leprosy. Amen. And he can clean sin. Amen. Amen.
Thank you, Jesus. That desire. Thank you, Lord. For seeing you. You know how the devil works? I'm going to give you my theology on it. <laughs> First thing the old devil does is he gets right here. That's yeah, it, preacher. Man. Come on, man. Buddy. He gets right here. He gets playing in our head. Imagination. Hey, man, he gets telling us all kinds of different things in our head. And then he causes the eyes. Yeah. Amen. The wall. Yeah, that's right. Amen. Boy, I'm telling you, as long as you keep your eyes up on the cross, yeah, amen, on, amen, keep your eyes up on Jesus, yeah, that's keep right. your heart clean, oh, you oh, got oh, it made. Oh, amen. The devil says, I need to do something, so number one, I'll put a distraction in their mind. Amen. Mm -hmm. And then I'll cause their eyes uh, to look upon it. Amen. Mm -hmm. He didn't he didn't take Eve straight to the tree. Boy, he filled her full of junk. Amen. Before yeah, he ever got her over. Yeah. Listen, boy, I'm telling you, the devil will not lead you right directly out in the sea. He'll fill your head with a lot of garbage. Amen. Yeah, yeah. And then he'll present it to you. That's, That's right. Amen. That's right. And then he's got you so confused. Amen. That you don't know what to do. Preach on. Amen. Listen, leprosy is a picture of sin. Yep. In the 13th chapter of the book of Leviticus. Read it. Yep. When that leper came to Jesus, if the will, Pharisees Lord. and the Sadducees, if I will, Lord. They, man, they said, how in this world can this man who's claiming to be who he is can have any dealings with this leper? How in the world can he reach down and, and touch him Knowing that he has this leprosy, because he gonna wind up with one thing they didn't realize. Amen. That God is bigger than any leprosy Amen. that's on the face Amen. of the earth, and God is bigger than any sin that we've ever carried right. around, and He's able to touch us in Amen. such a way, Amen, that He can cleanse Amen. us up. Amen. Praise Amen. the Lord. And they told Him, said, "Well, what? Who is this man that will sin in thee with the publicans and the sinners?" Amen. And when Jesus heard it, you know what He told? He said, "I didn't come to save the right; I come to save Amen. them that is lost. I said my blood." Amen. That people might have eternal life. Amen. 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 This morning, sir, this morning. What he said. <coughs> this morning, you got diseases like a leper. Mm. You got some of the side marks <laughs> of a leper. This morning, in here, you carrying away. <coughs> You carried some secret sins that you're sitting there this morning thinking God don't know anything about. It. You're dead wrong. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. God knows even what we think. Amen. Before we ever thought it. Well, it says about He knows every step that our feet is going to take. Amen. Before they ever take. Hey Amen. He knows where our hearts at. Sure does. Hey Amen. Boy, America's got a problem. Yes, Lord. They got a heart problem. Woo! The heart problem is, is they don't know Jesus. That's right. Amen. They don't know Him. He's the only hope. And the free pardon of sin. I was talking to somebody the other day, and I asked them. I said, "Do you know Jesus?" They said, "Yes, sir." I stood there a few minutes and I looked at them. I said, you know Donald Trump? They said, yes, sir. I said, how many times you ever met Donald Trump? Shook his hand. Well, they said, well, I ain't never been that close to him. Mm -hmm. I said, how many times you ever been in a place where he was speaking and you sat there and you listened to him? Well, I can't remember any time that I've ever done that. I said, then you really don't know him. <laughs> Come on, preacher. They said, oh, yeah, we know him. I said, no, you know about him. <laughs> yeah. You know right. about him. See, yeah. there's a lot of people know about Jesus. That's right, that's right. But they don't realize what Jesus Amen. can do for Amen, that's good. God's the best thing yep. that can ever happen. Amen. Yep. God's here to help you this morning. Sure is. He passed by that road in Mark. Yep. Amen, because he already knew that old leper needed help. If I will, Lord, I can He came by grace independence on Olivia Road this morning because he knows somebody 
needed some help. Amen. Amen. He was going to offer it one more time. He's going to give one more chance. Yeah. Amen. To get the help. You know what would have happened to that leopard if that leopard had never come to Jesus? No. When Jesus walked by, he'd have still been a leopard. Yeah. Amen. You know what happens this morning? If you're in here and you're lost and not done without God, and you fail to come to Him this morning, when you walk out them doors, you're still going to be lost and not done. Amen. Without God. That was the leper's opportunity. Yep. Today is your opportunity. Mm -hmm. Today is your opportunity. I'm going to tell you what I try. I try my level best to stay just as close to God Me too. as I can. Me too, brother. Hey Amen. There are times, boy, the old devil does make Brother Robert like he does everybody else. He's up on my bandwagon sometimes. Like, man, boy, I'm telling you, I get over here and I unlock that door. I come in and get down around this old altar and say, God, I need some help. Amen. I need some help. Lord, you know the devil's right here after me. God, I need some help. I need some strength. That's right. Amen. That comes from above. And you know what? He never has failed me. Amen. 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 Let me down because I know where to run to when I'm in trouble. Amen. Listen this morning. Well, if that old leopard hadn't to come to Jesus, he'd have still been a leopard. If the sinner doesn't come to Jesus, he'll still be a sinner. Amen. Amen. Because there's not but one way to be saved. He had a player coming back, saw the leader come. I wonder this morning with every head bowed, every Christian man walking and pray, nobody looking around. I wonder this morning, are they one to slip your hand up, take it right back down, say, Preacher, I need some help.